Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel it for you Today we are going to discuss how to create a fast food poster by using Adobe Photoshop. For this we first need to go to Adobe Photoshop. Here I have a white background. Firstly, we are going to add some gradient to this background. For this we need to go to the create new fill. Look for the gradient and click on it. Now look for the style drop down and change it to radial. Now go to select color of gradient. Set its color according to your requirement. Here I am going to use combination of red and maroon. Now I am adjusting its opacity to 100%. So now here we have attractive looking background. Now go to the pen tool and select curvature pen tool. Now make sure to select shape from its properties. Now select its fill, I am selecting here yellow, but you can select color according to your requirement. Now follow the step and start drawing a shape with curvature pen tool. So here we created a shape with a yellow color which look like a design. Now select gradient layer and create a copy of it by pressing Ctrl plus J. Now select the copy of gradient layer and the layer of shape you have created and press Ctrl plus E to merge them. Now go to filter and look for filter gallery and click on it. Now you can select some filter from here according to your requirement. I am going to select sprayed stroke here. Now set its stroke length and spray radius according to your requirement. Now we have done with the background and now we are going to add some image and text here. Now here we have a picture of pizza and I am going to drag it on my background. Resize your image by pressing Ctrl plus T and adjust the size of image according to the background. Here we go, I have adjusted the image according to my requirement. Now I going to add some shadow of this pizza. For this, go to the shapes and select ellipse tool. Now follow the step and create a shape which closely look like to a shadow. I have created a shape here and now I am going to select its fill to black. Readjusting the size of shape. Here we go. Now go to the filter, look for the blur, now look for the Gaussian blur in the drop down menu of blur. And click on it. Now choose convert to smart object. Now set the radius according to your requirement, and click OK. Now we have done with the shadow of pizza. Now I am going to create a copy of pizza by pressing Alter plus mouse click, and drag it beside to this image. Here we go. Now resizing the image and repositioning it. Now create some more copies of pizza to add them in a background theme to make a creative look of a background. Resize and reposition the image according to your requirement. Now go to filter and add Gaussian blur to this image. Now create some more copies of it and adjust it in different places on the background. Now readjusting the image of small pizza to look more attractive. Readjusting the position of pizza. Now I am going to add some drop shadow to a small pizza to avoid their color dissolving in each other. Adjust the parameters of drop shadow according to your requirement. And then click OK. Here we go. Now we are going to add some text layers on it. Now I am going to create a heading of this poster. Resizing and readjusting the heading. Now adding some more text. Now resizing and readjusting it. Now add a text for logo or you can also place here a logo. In my case I am adding a text reflects as a logo. Now resizing it and set its color to white. Now adding some more necessary details which is required on a poster. Here we go. Our creative fast food poster has now been created. 
Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. For more related videos comment us on comment box. And must subscribe the page. Have a nice day.